was a great band, and I feel sorry because I've seen a lot of musicians, this will happen, that one particular group will adopt a song as their anthem or whatever, and, and I did an article on Freebird for Musician Magazine, pretty fascinating story. It turned out it was a song that they wrote, and there was a they were at a wedding, and they started playing Hava Nagila in the middle of it, and that's kind of how that breakdown part, but regardless of that, I've almost gotten killed several times for saying something smart when they wanted to hear Freebird, and then, at first it was Whippet Post, and then yeah, Whippet yeah, Post yeah. was replaced by Freebird, which was replaced by Stairway to Heaven. Okay. So, somewhere along the way, I decided to be a smart ass and write a song called Stairway to What You're Looking At, Stairway to What the Hell Are You Looking At, Buddy Freebird. And uh, <laughs> this song kind of metamorphosized into a, it was a joke at one time, but it kind of became its own reality. And it's the kind of thing that I would do in like bike week or something like this. I go, all right, we're going to do this before you go. I'm not hurting the piano, don't worry. It's dedicated to all the other musicians that have suffered through this. studies are aesthetically pleasing. Here comes some peckerhead little geek with a big Y in his cheek. And he's yelling in my face, hey, thank you, play free bird. He's telling you what happened. He just finished a pint of Jack, washed it down with a few Prozac. And those twitchy muscles in his neck, 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 got me a little bit neck, neck. Worried. His friends tell me that's a Mr. Fraser Hill. He just got out of Buncombe County Jail. His old lady's wearing a beaded halter top. Her name is Grace. She gives me a big, wet, sloppy kiss. Says, hey, boy, come here, look at this. Shows me her tattoo of Wally Coyote chasing the roadrunner. Into an unbelievable place. 20 years ago, when I did this song, that was a point of shock when people were now they go, oh, that's my massage therapist. I, I figure, what the hell? I play a tune and all will be swell. I finished my first song and here comes a beer bottle. My ear. Someone yells, let's squash him flat. Someone else yells, oh, heard that. I realize that evolution might still be optional here. Now, one of the things that's funny is, you know, we make all these jokes about Skinner and all this stuff, and at the same time make jokes about aging, and you realize we're not that far from being those, you know, old folks ourselves. This next song here is another song about Florida and redneck bars and life like that, and this is a song about being in the parking lot of the Cracker Barrel in St. Augustine, Florida, and almost dying in the hands of a snowbird. 25 years of playing in bars, people young for Freebird playing that last song and not getting killed. I've had 27 kidney stones. Crazy wife. And I've been through. And I'm glad to be here with you today for happy hour. Welcome to the Marriott here in the Satellite Beach. How many folks we got from Michigan? I think it's a fun Anyway, this is a song I wrote about living down there in Florida. Grandma, dear grandma, we must say goodbye. But you know the thing is, when they start legalizing marijuana in the state of Florida, we're going to have the double whammy of people getting old plus being high on the weed, riding down there at like 30 God. miles an hour in our big Lincolns going, Mrs. is going to be queen in that, buddy! You know, so, grandma, dear grandma, we must say goodbye. It's going to be a cold winter here in Hackensack. Mama, don't cry. You weather the storm, the old big race of last nearly run. Time for you to head down to Volusia County to your 24 hour gated community with bus service to the mall on Tuesday and Friday, double price bingo on Saturday, two for one king crab legs, limit one door customer, 10% off with of the coupon in the sun. Even 
night. She's been drinking, got jersey plates on the late model lake. Stopping on the green light and going on the red and hugging. She has two hands in that new blue head. Look out, look out, look out. About the time of day for her to take a nap. The 30 in the fence, Elena, happy as can be. Bust a man, a bustle, and the Lawrence Welch, she need to look out, look out. Grandma's behind the wheel. Riding down the road in the big, long automobile. Sing along, children. Say, drive, drive Granny, drive. drive. Everybody now. Drive, Granny, drive. Now, see, now, you guys know drive. what to do. The other people in the back are going, oh, we're part of a cult up here. All right, <laughs> What, what we want you to do is when you say drive, get drive, to make it even better, put your hands up. Oh. Just kind of like by your head like grandmother doing the steering wheel like that, all right? Oh. That's kind of ignorant, but if everybody from the back does it up to the front, it'll be good, all right? Just don't look at the other person. Just look at me right here and don't worry about looking dumb, all right? <laughs> You guys were singing it, huh? That's great. That's great. <laughs> Not quite so much in the middle, but all right. Okay, try it here. Now this time, bring it down a little bit and bring the head down just a little bit like that. All right. Now this is even bigger. Are these? Are... So you gotta wait until the week, end of the week before you get to do all the really ignorant stuff. All right. <laughs> No. You got to do with us. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. But anyway, this time you can bring it, bring it down like this and bring the head down. Then maybe bring your head just kind of like the first time your dog said, the first time your dog saw a ceiling fan after he blew bomb smoke in his face. Kind of like that. All right, try it. Oh, he knows you got the look already. No, you got it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ready? Here we go. Drive, drive, drive. Everybody. Wait, wait, wait. Say it, drive, Granny, drive. Everybody now. Drive, Granny, drive. Drive, Granny, drive. One more time. Drive, Granny, drive. By the way, what about a hand for all the folks working with us? Woo! Woo! So much. Reverend Billy Seward says my name for those of y'all that don't know me. And we're back for the Blues Cruise again. We'll be back in 10 minutes. Stick around. Hey! 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 And then on top of that, we have a circle of. Coming right up. Coming right up. Okay. Sure. It's beautiful. It's not too dark. It's not me, it's blue. Okay, good. Stay here. It's not me, it's blue. 